identify the types of carriers so if you see this particular figure you must be able to understand that this particular is a primary molar it is a milk tooth and this is basically d right and it looks like of the lower arch right now here if you see this particular area is the proximal interdental area right so that is going to be the distal surface of this particular d that is primary first molar primary first molar it has to be the distal surface of this right now if you try to figure out more information about this so you should be uh, seeing here that this tooth looks quite healthy even this canine looks quite healthy and here you can see there is a carious lesion on the proximal surface right now what are the options here one you have the secondary caries now secondary caries are generally seen in uh, below the restorations if you have already restored tooth then only the, these secondary caries will be done there is no restoration seen here so we can rule out this particular answer now rampant caries now rampant caries is a kind of carry that is uh, kind of acutely as well as the it is going to be very uh, extensive in nature so that must be involving a lot of teeth in the individuals so if you see other teeth are very healthy only one tooth is having problems so you can um, you know exclude the rampant caries as well now pit and fissure caries and smooth surface caries so if you see this is neither the pit or fissure this looks to be the proximal surface area the distal surface area so you can rule out the pit and fissure as well and you can choose the smooth surface caries now if i just come back to the smooth surface caries the smooth surface caries are generally seen in the interdental area that is the proximal area or these can be seen in the cervical third of the teeth where the more plaque is there and that is hard to be cleared right now there are certain caries which are known as the root caries or the cemental caries these are generally seen in the patient which are old which have the recession and due to the recession they will be exposure and there will be more chances of developing of the caries on the surface of the root okay so these are the five various kind of caries and this is one of the very uh, direct question so if you see here the proximal caries are there and these are going to be smooth surface caries now these smooth surface caries can be of like two three types if we just see here so the smooth surface caries are going to be three location one is your proximal surface of the posterior and anteriors which we have seen already facial and lingual surface uh, cervical third of the crown of the teeth as well as root surface caries so we have discussed all the uh, possible caries interdental cervical third and the root caries which are seen in the old people that is in the recession cases so answer to this question is going to be of course your option number four that is smooth surface caries are going to be uh, are, are here uh, depicted in this particular picture